excited. We're going to hear from them a, a little bit later on in the show. But first, look who's here. So cool, this is Del Marva Life. This is something I watch on YouTube a lot. I didn't know it was an actual show here in Delaware. But, let me give folks see a, another review here. I am at the Anchorage Motel in Rehoboth. We'll look outside here. There's the sign just to prove it. Anchorage Motel. Really very pleased. Others may have different opinions. But as you can see, these um a, a lot of this is new here. It is pretty new. A whole whole lot of this I, I think was redone in the last, I don't know, year or two or three. But the the, the siding, the walkway, the rails here, everything looks really new. So this is I think unofficially known as Rehoboth's best budget hotel. And I was having fun looking around the, the parking lot a minute ago, looking at the cars, trying to decide what we really had here. And, uh, you know, I see Ford, Beamer, Ford, Infinity. Oh, it's at a uh, Camaro, I guess. Um, an older Cherokee in awesome condition right there in great shape. Someone's uh, doing that car really good. Uh, let's see. I think Genesis, Ford, Ford. There's my car. This is Tesla. Malibu. Another Camaro. A lot of Camaros. Anyways. The place is really, really not bad. Um, I'm going to compare it to some places in Gettysburg. And, uh, you know, it's, it's older decor. It's dated looking inside here. I mean, outside they did a great job, like I said, kind of recently it looks like. But, um... There it is, the Anchorage Motel. It is very, very, very decent. Look, this place is is not you know snazzy at all. Um, you gotta hunt down outlets for your wall chargers. Um, the decor. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. I mean, it's like you know. That's from the 70s, guys. You know, they haven't had a decorator here in, I don't know, four decades or so. But, 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 the place is clean. The place is really, really clean. So I'll give you a bed check here. Pull it all back. Let's just pull it all back. Doing good so far? Doing good so far? Now this is where it gets fun. Okay. Now, what do we got under here? Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good, wouldn't you say? How about right in this corner? Ah, look at that. Very good, very nice. It passes. This place here, guys, is $120 in season, in the summer. It's crazy. Yeah, I'm still reading this darn book. Look, that th there are a lot of reasons. I keep putting it down. There's certain parts that I'm trying to hone in on and, and certain parts that I'm not. So uh, I, I don't normally <laughs> take months 
with a book you know I'm, I'm a book juggler and that's one of a couple and I just got one more added to the list that was a gift so I've got to read that welcome to the beach Woo! so it's been a fun couple days here so far I'm back in Delaware and I'm saving some money you know I got money in the bank I, I could have stayed uh, just about anywhere I wanted and um, I'm, I'm just being real frugal here guys I uh, I was kind of in a weird mood of, of even to come down for a couple days because my plans got changed a little bit but uh, here I am so official uh, score for the the Anchorage Motel here in, um, in Rehoboth <clears throat> I have to do everything by the price point by the price point I want to give it a 9 out of 10. Um, there are only a couple slight deductions. Um, there's a little bit of stain in the carpet. Now, I, I don't, I'm not saying that this carpet is filthy. They're, they're, those are two different, you know, statements. Eh, this light's not working. Um, <laughs> you can see, you know, a little bit right there. Um, Almost a little dodgy to walk around in your bare feet, but, you know, a little bit right there. <clears throat> but seriously, it's, it's not bad. Look, the great thing is here, they've got a, a really pretty new, um, I always check out the AC unit, you know, they're, they're largely all the same, but you, you're looking at the age and the condition. The age and the condition on this thing is awesome, and it has been blowing all night, and let me tell you what, I woke up cold. I actually had to turn the heat up. I think it was set to like 67 and I woke up and I was freezing. So huh, that's kind of a good problem to have in these situations, right? Kind of a good problem to have. I didn't realize it was set so cold. Let me check out this mini fridge. I haven't even filled it up. Okay, mini fridge is good. Comes with a cheap chintzy microwave. Got your ice bucket. Now let's go to the bathroom. I think this bathroom is very, very, very clean and very cute. Um, because look at it. I mean, it's really pretty small to be honest, but it's very, very clean. Take you on in here. Look, look, look at that. Look at that. No hairballs, furballs, nasty stains, nothing like that at all. Nope, nope, nope. Very, very clean. No hair at all. Toilet, very clean. See, you always get checked behind places. My mama taught me that. <laughs> how to look for stuff and how to clean. Right? You gotta look behind stuff, pull stuff up. Now, this is what I think is really cute. This, uh, this, this small little countertop, it almost feels like a, you know, school desk, caddy, you know, kind of something like that. But, um, but it works. You know, it's smart. They fit a lot, you know, they, they, the plumbing's right here, they hang the, the toilet paper right there, and, and they make a lot of a use out of not much space. Um, so, you know, I mean, this isn't high living here, guys, and I'm not putting the place down. It's just, this is what it is. This is pure budget. But it's very clean, and I like it, and it's $120. I paid $240 for two nights at the beach here in season. So they get pretty high marks, you know. I am taking off minor points for carpet stains, minor points for... <laughs> All right, that there were some kind of, you know, salty looking folks outside, not nasty or dangerous or, or you know, what have you. I, I don't know what other terms to use. Um. You know, the place is cheap. But like I said, you look around, you look at your neighbors, you look at the cars, and it's not like they're all, you know, nasty old buckets and uh, people with no money. Anyways, I'm going to go find some breakfast, guys. Going to get me down to um, Honey's in Lewis. Honey's is supposed to be real good. And out of all the times I've been to Lewis, I've been to Lewis, Delaware a million times. And I never stopped in Honey's, and I can't tell you why, but I'm going to check it out this morning, so hope it's good.
And until then, I'll see ya.